I think this is pretty cool. Um, so if you watch this with the volume down a bit, I think all I would do is, you know, he seems really, really upset. So to me, there are a couple of poses that kind of soften that too much. This beginning pose and this end pose is a bit much. I'm going to tell you why. Also, at first, I didn't. I mean, if there's anything you can do to make this more like a phone, I know this is a minor thing, but I wasn't quite understanding what he was doing. At first, I was looking at what this is, but then I realized, okay, wait, wait that sound is that someone on the phone. Oh, okay, this block is a phone. Let's make sure that that's uh, very clear. What are you saying, Jerry? Three, three people who weren't alive anymore. Like that, that to me is the best part. I know you're gonna laugh, but watch his head. Three people who weren't alive anymore because. Because he seems very, very upset, right? And you can hear in the voice how he has a problem saying things and all that stuff. And that section is really, that's going to really sell the twitchy nature, um, you know, that he's in right now. So anything, as you continue on to add all the detail, is to have that in the hands. But a lot of it is in the head. And this right now, just, I mean, I know this is rough, but, you know, I would avoid things where he's moving slowly and moving arms slowly and stuff like that. Um... And you could have things where, what are you saying, Jerry? like you could you could have him like this, and the head a bit higher up, and looking around him. But he can also be nervous, you know. He can also think about, oh, someone's going to see me. So he can he can look around and have the head a bit higher, and then what are you saying? So when she says that, dart down, like he looks down. It's almost like he's surprised and shocked. Oh wait, there's someone there. So he could be looking to the left, then looks down and has, you know, eye darts. Like imagine he is looking at this point, this point, this point, this point, this point, this point. He's always looking, always looking. Again, not crazy eye darts so that he never focuses, but you know, definitely a lot of nervousness and panic and just and just he's just shaken. And then he can he can he could be staring the way you have it here. Three three people who weren't alive anymore because And then he go back into all we have here. As if me. And then that I like with the shoulder, I would just push that, you know, and have probably his hands really on his body. Those are my shoulders. <laughs> right? Like really bring the shoulders up and I would bring the hands to the chest. Like, you know, like he's really, he's almost trying to squeeze himself and like squeezing those words out. I feel terrible about it. And that is more like, oh, I'm so tired. So I'd be careful, like that would be really clamping the, the fingers and you know you could have the hands flat on the table with fingers almost like you know kind of up imagine now if you put your hand down on your table or where we are and now rotate up the fingers and like tense in those and, like imagine you're doing this with slight slides on the table you know it's making it very very tense and uncomfortable and then this this is more like oh i like to me, open palms and everything and head inside is very comforting almost. So that to me would be and also we don't see the face anymore and it doesn't the sound doesn't sound muffled like he has his hand over his mouth. So imagine you're doing this, right? But if there's any way with the pose and it could be maybe it might look weird, but you can see how much you can get away with it where the head is Yeah, no, see I want actually the the to call like the uh, foreheads, you know, so the mouth is here, and then that's his head. So the forehead is on the table, and then imagine if we can somehow bring it in without covering the face. The hand is up here and is holding the top part, you know, that type of pose. With the hair. So he has his arms above the head, and you can see. The mouth and that way forehead on table is not comfortable and he's still not comfortable you know what i mean so you choose a pose and and the way he is interacting with things that also makes it uncomfortable and he is you know definitely still uncomfortable um but yeah that's it very cool uh, those are kind of my my own little tweaks that i would uh suggest thanks all right there's an email, you can sign up, you can start whenever you want, you can submit whenever you want, you get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right, thank you.